Hi, I'm Michaela Rogers, an environmental scientist with the Kentucky Department of Fish and Wildlife Resources. Today we're at the Salado Wildlife Education Center at Salado's Bee Tree. Since it's National Pollinator Week, we're going to talk about how bees are for more than just honey. And for this, we're going to start by talking about our honeybees, which do live in social colonies together, which you can see in this bee tree behind us. So within the trunk of the tree, you can see an entire beehive. And while this tree has been on exhibit for a while, this colony is actually only a couple months old. So this is a new colony. Next, we're gonna zoom in on one single honeybee, just so you can get a better look of what, what those look like up close. And so our honeybees are important because they're a critical pollinator for our agriculture. Um, honeybees are responsible for pollinating one to five billion in crops annually, and they're actually considered a livestock animal, which not many people know. We also have bumblebees in Kentucky, and so these are another very important pollinator. These play a critical role for pollination of things we like to eat like blueberries and tomatoes. These bees are ground nesting, and they can also be social, but they, not all species will be. Um, one interesting thing about bumblebees is they're able to pollinate in colder temperatures, which some species cannot. There are approximately 12 species of bumblebee in Kentucky, um, but those are also not our only bees. We also have carpenter bees. And so these are actually the largest species of bee that you'll find in Kentucky. Some people don't really like carpenter bees because they can get into untreated wood, um, but they are really important pollinators. And these bees are also going to be solitary bees. Um, and then one other bee that we don't have an example of is our helictid bees. And you might know these by the nickname sweat bees. These are kind of those small metallic bees that you may not even think of as bees, um, but you'll see them on different flowers as kind of a little shiny green bee. One thing I wanna mention is that we have an activity um, that is called Bees Are For More Than Just Honey. This is gonna be posted after this video is. Um, and this shows you how you can make your own bumblebee finger puppet. So we already have a pre-cut one here that we're just gonna kinda show you how that works. So you'll have your bee cut out and then you'll also have your band cut out for the finger puppet. And all you'll need for that other than the scissors to cut it out is a piece of tape and you can tape the band under the honey or under the bee and make your finger puppet just like that. But with that, thank you all for tuning into our bees are for more than just honey and thank you for um, celebrating pollinators with us this week.